feel like I've seen that a few times, and that's probably an achievement for shooting those. That I have not acknowledged this entire time. Oh, Cauldron Lake. The eighth deepest lake in the world. I found that weird. To... Alright. Cauldron Lake is the Cal... Calendaria Lake formed from the volcanic crater. The vol... volcano itself could be considered... Or... Itself could be considered to be active, but it has not erupted since the volcanic earthquakes of 1970. And even then, the underground activity was com comparably mild, despite... Some property damage, there was no casualties. That's a lie. And we know it's a lie, because uh, the one dude lost his wife in the lake. Cauldron Lake is one of the most beautiful spots in the Bright Falls area, as well as the central figure for many local folk tales. It's a popular recreation area for area residents. Alright. Alright. We're gonna cross the bridge. Or how are we not at Mirror Peak Lookout yet? Coffee. Reloading my gun. Going fast in my car. Dun 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 dun. It's back here. Yep. Dun dun dun. Dun dun dun. Me in my car. Going fast in my car. No, I'm gonna keep using the hunting rifle. But thank you, game. We're almost done done this chapter. I think. I oh. had checked all of Stucky's rental cabins. There had been no sign of the wakes. It was dark when he'd found their car parked at the end of the road by Cauldron Lake. It made no sense. They must have taken a wrong turn. But there was no sign of them, and the car had been there for hours already. Frustrated, Mott stood on the rotten ruin of the footbridge that had once led to Diver's Isle before it sank beneath the waves years ago. The boss wouldn't be happy. Spooky. Um, what? Damn, Alan. Just climb things. Why you gotta be a savage all the time? 
Well, there's a thing down there. And there's what should have been a door right here, which is sealed off. Okay. And I think there was something in the house just a second ago. Tom? Tom! Tom is one of my favorite YouTube streamers. No, it's Thomasine. That is a lot of addiction to one man. I wonder if I would have stood on the outside of that if it would have fallen on me. Because I feel like that was a scripted fight. the spot where the island and the cabin had been. There was a light near it. It had to be a boat. I was close now. I, I tried to hold on to Alice, but her form melted away. I was losing control. Dr. Hartman stood in her place. I wanted to hit him, but my arms were jelly. He smiled. It was a reassuring smile, and I hated him for it. I had to give you a sedative. Don't fight it. You went through another rough period. Right now, it's very important that you stay calm. We don't want you to have another episode. You're a patient at my clinic. Have been for a while now. Had to get what? there fast. I dreaded what I would find.
All right. That is the end of episode three. We'll play out the music and then um, change games. So. <laughs>